Next story. NYTimes.com. Despondent Xi Jinping embraces lying flat. John Caleb Knowles. Four to five minutes. A crestfallen Xi Jinping has stunned the world by announcing his embrace of the lying flat movement, a social phenomenon advocating for a rejection of societal pressures to overwork and overachieve. This unprecedented move comes amidst China's mounting economic woes, a teetering real estate market, and the United States' resurgent strength, all of which have conspired to shatter Xi Jinping's dreams of unfettered Chinese dominance. In a recent speech, an uncharacteristically somber she said that he had come to realize that the lying flat movement was not about laziness or apathy, but rather about a desire for a more balanced and meaningful life. He said that he had been too focused on economic growth and national power and that he had neglected the importance of individual well-being and happiness. I, myself, will now be lying flat, he said. Xi's embrace of the lying flat movement is a significant shift in turn for the Chinese leader, who has long been known for his authoritarian style of rule and his relentless pursuit of economic growth. In the past, Xi Jinping has cracked down on protests and embraced the detention and merciless beating of dissidents while promoting a message of national rejuvenation through hard work and sacrifice. However, in recent months, the once invincible she has faced a number of setbacks. The Chinese economy, once the envy of the world, has slowed down significantly, with growth rates plummeting to levels not seen in decades. The real estate market, a key driver of China's economic growth, is on the verge of collapse, with debt-laden developers teetering on the brink of insolvency. In addition, the United States, long seen as a declining power, has made a number of moves to counter China's rise, including embargoing key AI components, investing in new technologies, strengthening its alliances with other countries in the Asia-Pacific region, and even reasserting its dominance in the South China Sea. These challenges have led to a growing sense of despondency among many Chinese citizens. The Lying Flat Movement, which emerged in mid-2021 has resonated with many Chinese people who are tired of the relentless pressure to work longer, earn more, and consume more. The movement has been met with both admiration and criticism, with some seeing it as a sign of apathy and resignation, while others view it as a necessary form of resistance against the excesses of Chinese Communist Party policy. Xi Jinping's embrace of the lying flat movement is likely to be seen as a concession to the growing public discontent in China. It is also a sign that Xi Jinping is willing to adapt his policies in the face of new challenges. However, the move is not without its risks. A prolonged period of lying flat could further slow down China's economy and undermine its global competitiveness. The move could also have a number of implications for China's future. It could lead to a more relaxed and less authoritarian style of rule. It could also lead to a more focus on individual well-being and happiness. Critics suspect that Xi's embrace of the lying flat movement is simply a tactical move designed to buy time. Xi may still be committed to his ultimate goal of making China the world's leading power, and he may only be willing to embrace the lying flat movement for as long as it is convenient for him to do so. Still, the change in policy has sparked optimism in some. Wang Tao, a 28-year-old entrepreneur from Shenzhen said, I think the lying flat movement is a necessary wake-up call for China. We have been so focused on material gains that we have neglected our own happiness and the well-being of our planet. It's time to find a more balanced approach to life. Zhang Wei, a 32-year-old software engineer from Beijing agreed. I am relieved that President Xi Jinping is finally acknowledging the importance of individual well-being. We are not just machines designed to produce economic output. We are human beings with desires and aspirations beyond work. But Li Mai, a 45-year-old factory worker from Shanghai, was skeptical, I am worried about China's future. If we all start lying flat, how will we compete with the United States? That country is full of drugs and perversion and they still outproduce us. We need to continue striving to achieve our full potential. Only time will tell what the long-term implications of Xi Jinping's embrace of the lying flat movement will be. However, it is clear that the move is a sign of the changing times in China.